Will you help us to ban the Bible? To ban the Bible? We just this is crazy. A lot of people are ready to sign the petition to ban the Bible. Watch this. Will you help us to ban the Bible? To ban the Bible? We're just trying to get rid of this hate speech just to help the New World Order. But Amazon is still selling it to a lot of people and we're just trying to get them to stop that. Why so. would I want to ban the Bible? Well, you know, it makes a lot of people feel uncomfortable. Uh, it's hurting a lot of people's feelings. Yeah. Just print here and yeah, print birthday and a signature. You know, the Bible hurts a lot of people's feelings and it makes a lot of people feel uncomfortable. And if we can get rid of it, you know, that'll really help with the new world order. A lot of people want to burn the existing ones, but maybe we can do that later. <laughs> Thank, you. Thank you. Amazon has finally stopped selling a lot of racist and anti-Semitic books by people like former KKK leader David Duke. They were selling his autobiography for years. They finally stopped selling it, but they're still selling the Bible. So we're just trying okay. to... So I'm just signing to not have the Bible be sold on Amazon? Yeah. Okay, that sounds like a good thing for humanity. You know, if somebody already purchased one, you know, I mean, at least at this point, we're not going to confiscate them, maybe in the oh, yeah. future, but we just don't want anybody else to be purchasing new right. copies. Good luck. Thank you. Have a good one. When you say hate speech, I want to make sure we're on the same page. Yeah. Well, the Bible has a lot of homophobia in there, and, um, you know, it, it says that the Jews conspired to have Jesus killed. It's an anti-Semitic trope, so we're just trying to get the Bible banned. To help stop the hate speech and I'm with, on board with you there. On board with us there. You know, I mean, for the people who have already bought one, I mean, at least at this point, we're not going to be confiscating them. Maybe in the future, but we're just trying to get the new purchases stopped yeah. and just ban it from all the stores. Thank okay. you so much. You. The Bible is the most sold book, so if we can get Amazon to stop selling that, we can we can help stop the hate speech. We're going to leave the Quran up there though. We don't want to be Islamophobic though. It's time we finally get rid of it once and for all. Thank you. I just cannot believe that people will stand out there with their conscience. This guy is uh, always, you know, exposing the evil, the darkness in America. So he's standing against all this whole thing, but he, he went out there to just to see how people will react on this. If people are willing and ready to sign petitions. And this is crazy. But you, you're not going to be hearing stuff, something like this on maybe preachers or anywhere, but because things like this goes under the table. They, they sneak it in so that people, media, people will not be talking about it. But it's crazy. If you go back, you know, they, they did this a couple of years ago all the time and the court keep on, kept on rejecting those things. But now in 2022, the bill is out there. Wow. In California, wow. This is crazy. The world is getting crazy and crazy and crazy every day. But listen, they will gather, they will plan, they will not prevail. The activities will not stand because God is on the throne and he always will destroy the activities or the plans of the enemy. Share this video. Stand against this ban this bill it will not stand all right god love you keep praying keep believing bye